Hey there, No Code community. Nelson here, and I want to tell you about the upcoming Udesli Chrome extension. Now, before I get into that, what is Udesli? Udesli is an adapter to help you convert your Webflow projects into themes for Shopify, WordPress, Ghost, or even Jamstack. So this is a great tool to keep in your back pocket. If you have clients that are on Shopify and they have too much data or don't want to migrate all over to the Webflow e-commerce. Same thing with WordPress. If you have clients on WordPress that have a ton of blog posts or a huge database of data and they can't migrate it over to Webflow CMS, this would be the tool to use. So how do you use Udesli? So if you scroll down here, you can see the four steps of no code. All you have to do is add custom attributes to the important elements on your project and then export your project's code. Upload that to the Udesli adapter and choose the platform you want to convert it to and convert. That's it. However, however, when using Udesli, the honest truth is that the first step, adding custom attributes, is the hardest part. And they have helpful documentation. They have a lot of documentation to help you out. However, it's still the hardest part because you have to understand which custom attributes to use, especially when it comes to page types and certain elements as far as like blog pages and, and so forth. Like this is the WordPress um, documentation. So. It can get a little bit confusing, and that's why the Udesli team is working on a one-click way to make this all happen, and they've done that already with Jamstack. So I'm going to do a demo of, a, a very quick demo of how to put it, uh, or how to convert your Webflow project into a Jamstack, a Jamstack website. So, all you have to do is just click on Chrome extension, install that Chrome extension, and then open up your Webflow project. And then right here, right there, that little guy, click it. And you Desly does its thing. And then it downloads a config file. And so with this config file, this is what you upload as well as your project's exported code. So let me do that right now. Let me go ahead and prepare zip, download zip, and let's go to Desly, go to the adapter, and we'll just upload it. So I want to use Jamstack, and I'm going to choose the zip file. There we go. So that's the zip file that I just exported out of Webflow. And for the configuration file, I'm going to choose the Udesli config. Convert, and that's it. That's it. I've converted it. So imagine doing that for Shopify and WordPress and Ghost. Like, one-click configuration. So this whole four-step thing could be even eh, three and a half steps. You know, like clicking that one Udesli button is very much a half step because there's, it's not that hard to click that button. So yeah, this is coming and super excited. I know this will help out a lot of community members in the no-code community because again, there's clients out there that have a lot of data on other platforms and it's really hard to migrate them over to Webflow. And if that's the case, this is a tool for you. So again, go ahead and check out udesly.com. That's U-D-E-S-L-Y.com. Try out the Jamstack uh, converter now just to see how it works and experience that. And yeah, I can't wait. And great job to the Udesly team. So try it out and let me know what you think. All right, see ya.